Capricorn. It's a week of your head over your heart, thinking more logically um, than with your heart with some things, because... I, I don't know because. Why did I say that? No. You're more disciplined. You're truthful. You're being more truthful with yourself. There's a sense of honesty, mental clarity, and taking authority. You are healing your heart. Yes, the heart hurts somehow, whatever it is, but it will mend in time. So it's like head over heart this week, definitely. I do see a lot of you taking your power back. Now, this is a new way of thinking, okay? If you see birds coming in, you know, when they form a triangle and they're flying, they could be your spirit, animal, or message. No matter what this week, you are going to be victorious. Things are going to work out for you when you least expect it. I do see that energy, okay? I see a Leo energy, a Taurus energy, Libra energy, Cancer energy. You have a lot of energies around you. So you could be surrounded by a lot of people or this is just, they're coming into focus. Pay attention to what's going on around you. Um, sometimes when we hear things or we just listen more, we understand more. Someone from the past may be coming back. Some of you are reconciling. You're going to get what you want. A lot of focus on the future. Dreams could be potent. These are night dreams, also daydreaming. Creating own reality. A wish is going to come to fruition. You're going to be putting a stop to anyone who's been taking advantage of you. You have a new spiritual and emotional path. You're healing. This is counting your blessings this week. Meditation, getting rest, separating from negativity. Okay? Watch your health and well-being. So rest is important because things can start moving quickly. It could be a fast moving week. I do feel here also you could be concerned about someone else's um, health. I'm seeing that for some of you. I do see for some of you this is travel, moving. Um, for some of you, this is taking a trip with someone. Not traveling alone. For others of you, thoughts of moving. And I do feel here that... Um, you're more energetic or taking care of the health as a, fo a focus on your own overall health and well-being. You're more health conscious, so I see that energy. You're leaving some of the troubles behind you, definitely, okay, with the help of someone else, too. Um, there is truths that are going to come out or be revealed, powerful in your beginnings and communications here as well. Um, I do feel here fear feeling trapped. You may feel differently about a situation. This could be just say you've had a bad habit or a craving for something and now you just don't like it anymore. You used to drink Diet Coke. You can't stand it anymore. Um, I'm seeing that kind of change for some of you. That's, that's just an example. So that's definitely showing up there. Um... There is someone who's living vicariously through you. This person can be a critic, can be talking nasty or gossiping behind your back. But I'm telling you, your words have power. And I do see slow, steady, um, and just know that this person actually is going to chew or it's going to come back to them. You know, it's like karma. What goes around comes around. So I do feel that energy. For some of you, you need to open your heart to give and receive love. Okay, so I see that you're definitely picking and choosing who you want to communicate with. And it's definitely your head over your heart this week, too. Um, I do see you making a lot of progress, but things are very slow. It's like, you know, that slow and steady wins the race is definitely what I'm picking up here. So this is really good. 
um, energy. You're not too quick to jump into anything new. You're going to weigh your options with things too. I do see for some of you, it's like two's companies, three's a crowd. Someone is interfering in your life or sticking their nose where it doesn't belong. I do feel that this can also with love be cautious because there is a third party involved. So I do see that energy too. Uh, for some of you, this is contemplating a, you know, it's a make it or break it with a relationship, separation or divorce. Uh, for others of you, mending, um, mending something there too. Uh, for some of you too, I do feel you're breaking free of some kind of heartache or um, some kind of separation that could have happened. Money can be coming through. This is good if you're getting divorced. This could be a great financial settlement. Um, so I do see that money that's owed to you may be coming. This is also moving um, financial stability. Definitely showing up here. Financial independence. Um, this is being comfortable as well. It can be a change of direction with work career too. So I do see that energy coming through as well. Definitely a week of taking back your power. And you're definitely healing. Okay. And it's your head over your heart this week too.